Hello and welcome to another episode of Cooking with John. Labor Day is right around the corner, so I thought it'd be really good to make some beer brats. We have to boil them with beer and throw them on the grill later, but I have Megan here from The Neighbors, also with Nibbling with The Neighbors. Hello everyone, so you should go check out The Neighbors, uh, where we used to be the neighbors of Nikki and John. Found Kevin and our parents. Yeah, and we do daily vlogs and a lot of other things, challenges, and... And they have a lot of pets, so check them out. A zoo. So the first thing that we're going to do is we're going to pour the beer in the pot and we're going to boil the broth for 10 to 12 minutes and we'll go ahead and light the grill and we'll finish them on there. And you might need to be 21 to get the beer, but when you boil the beer it actually will evaporate all the alcohol so there won't be any alcohol actually going into the broths. And you want to go ahead and just take 4 to 6 beers, pour them out in the pan and then go ahead Throw it on the burner, you can put your brats right in there. Turn the burner on high and just let it sit for 10 to 12 minutes. And then we'll take the brats out and we'll go ahead and put them on the grill. Yay. Oh, I saw in the comment section you guys asked what movie we watched last night. And She's ended in up the way. Mad Max. So the brats have been boiling for about 10 to 12 minutes. And now the next step is to actually take them off the stove and set them in the bowl. And then we'll take them outside, throw them on the grill and finish them up. But this actually just, it kind of pre-cooks the broth a little bit. And the beer really moisturizes the meat inside of the actual broth. So it comes out tasting absolutely delicious. And it makes them a hundred times better than just throwing them on the grill and cooking them. Alright, so now Megan's actually going to take the broth and put them on the grill for us. Okay. Oh yeah. I thought <laughs> like, you were going to tell me yeah, something wrong. Uh, uh. <laughs> yeah, right across the middle there on the, the hottest part of the grill, which is in the middle where the coals are. And we're going to let these cook for about five minutes on one side, flip them over five minutes on the other side, flip them over five minutes, and flip them over another five minutes for a total of 20 minutes. We're just going to flip them every five minutes. Well done. Look at that. Mm. Mm. You think they look good. They smell good. You can also mix a variety of spices. Uh, inside of your beer when you boil these as well. It's just something I decided not to do because they come out tasting pretty good anyways. And you can see they're just bursting with juice right there. They're absolutely delicious. Five, five minutes on one side. I'll probably do five minutes on the next side and then just kind of turn them around, uh, rotate them from spot to spot. But the grills run really hot tonight and they are going to be done before we know it. Bad boys are done. Let's take them inside. See how they taste. Looks really good, Dave. Mm, let's dig in. Mm. Ketchup mustard and the secret is sauerkraut. You gotta have fresh sauerkraut. Cause I don't want sauerkraut. So we're gonna dig in. I've got sauerkraut on mine. So Megan. Yeah, sauerkraut. Mmm. Mmm, 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 That is a delicious broth. Mm -hmm. That's good. Good cooking. Good John. Well, another great video, another great thing to cook for a perfect three day weekend barbecue. Thanks for watching, guys. I'm John from Cooking with John. I'm enjoying my broths here, but we're going to wind this up. We're going to head out on the town. It's Friday night. We're just going to have a good time hanging out with our friend Megan. And a special thanks to her for being in my cooking video today. Make sure you guys check out the neighbors and also nibbling with the neighbors. There'll be a link in the description below.